14th problem. Find the value of k if the length of the tangent length of the tangent from 2 comma 5 to x square plus y square minus 5 x plus 4 y plus k is equal to 0 is root 37. That means, this problem is related to the length of the tangent. Okay. Let us recall how to find out length of the tangent from a point drawn to the circle. So, the length of the tangent is given by root s 1 1 where s is equal to 0. This is actually s 1 1 is known as average structure or notation the notation is given by length of the tangent is equal to root s 1 1. So, that means now given equation of the circle x square plus y square minus 5 x plus 4 y plus k is equal to 0. Length of the tangent is given. So, length of the tangent, length of the tangent equal to root 37. So, that means root s 1 1 is equal to root 37 squaring on both sides s 1 1 is equal to 37 s 1 1 means in this equation 2 comma why we have to replace. So, that means 2 square plus 5 square minus 5 into 2 because minus 5 x plus 4 y 4 into 5 plus k which is equal to 37. Now, 4 plus 25 minus 10 plus 20 plus k is equal to 37. This is 29 plus 10 plus k is equal to 37. k plus 39 is equal to 37. k is equal to 37 minus 39 that is minus 2. Therefore, k is equal to minus 2. Understood? Have you followed the steps? Once again go through it. Length of the tangent is equal to root s 1 1 that is given root 37. So, s 1 is equal to 37. Substituting 2 comma 5 we get k is equal to minus 2. Fifteenth question. Find the value of k if the length of the tangent length of the tangent from 5 comma 4 to x square plus y square plus 2 k y 
is equal to 0 is 1. Okay. Now, the length of the tangent is drawn from phi comma 4 to the circle x square plus y square plus 2 k y is equal to 0 is 1. So, now we need to find out the value of k. That means, here root s 1 1 is equal to 1 given squaring on both sides s 1 1 is equal to 1 only substitute x is equal to 5 y is equal to 4 in this equation and it is being equated to 1. So, that we get the value of 1. Okay. Let us proceed given x square plus y square plus 2 k y is equal to 0. This is the given equation of the circle. Length of the tangent given, length of the tangent equal to 1 unit that means 1 unit. So, formula root s 1 1 is equal to 1 squaring on both sides we get s 1 1 is equal to 1. So, s 1 1 means phi comma 4 is replaced in x for phi y for 4. So, we get phi square plus 4 square plus 2 k y plus 2 k into 4 and equated to 1 25 plus 16 plus 8 k is equal to 1. Now, this can be written 8 k plus 41 equal to 1, 8 k is equal to 1 minus 41. So, minus 40 k equals to minus 40 divided by 8, 8 1 ja 8 5 ja minus 5 by 1 that is minus 5. Therefore, therefore k is equal to minus 5. Once again just go through the problem. Okay. Have you followed? Okay, better practice this problem. Sixteenth problem. Find the equation. of polar of 1 comma minus 2 with respect to with respect to circle x square plus y square minus 10 x minus 10 y plus 25 is equal to 0. We have to find out the equation of the polar of 1 comma minus 2 with respect to the circle x square plus y square minus 10 x minus 10 y plus 25 is equal to 0. This is the direct problem. The polar of x 1 comma y 1 with respect to the circle s is equal to 0 is given by s 1 is equal to 0. What is s 1? So, let us have a discussion. Now, given x square plus y square minus 10 x minus 10 y plus 25 is equal to 0. This is the equation of the circle and point is given. 
say x1 comma y1 is equal to 1 comma minus 2. The equation the equation of polar with respect to circle S is equal to 0 is given by S 1 is equal to 0. This is the formula. Now, S 1 means x x 1 plus y y 1 plus g of x plus x 1. This is the notation. This is also called as abridged structure g of x plus x 1 plus f of y plus y 1 plus constant c is equal to 0. So, that means what we need to do means replace x 1 means 1, y 1 means minus 2, g means actually half of minus 10 that is minus 5, f means minus 5, c means 25. So, x 1 is 1, so x into 1, y 1 means minus 2, y into minus 2, minus 5 of x plus 1, minus 5 of y minus 2 plus 25 is equal to 0. So, in order to get the equation, just let it be simplified, that is only. So, okay. now we get x minus 2 y minus 5 x minus 5 minus 5 y plus 10 plus 25 is equal to 0. Now, minus 5 x plus x minus 4 x minus 7 y this is 35 minus 5 plus 30. Multiply minus 1 on both sides. So, we get 4 x plus 7 y minus 30 is equal to 0. Therefore, the equation of the polar with respect to given circle is 4 x plus 7 y minus 30 equal to 0. Have you followed my dear students? Okay, I think you might have followed this one.